I made it this far, but thank God for each moment every day. Three kids, mom, dad, Carter, a stock car. I feel a left turn coming this way. Let's make a left turn, left turn, left turn. Left turn, living, left turn, living. I feel a left turn coming this way. So I'm coming off the trailer, I'm running down there, I, you know, from from what I'd seen, I felt like Carter was physically okay, so all I could think about is, oh man, we just take, taken the points lead, and here we go, now we're going to get a DNF, did not finish, and we're going to get docked in the points. And I knew tempers would be flaring with the other drivers, the other crews. And so we knew everybody would be hot, but once I got down there, I saw that Carter's car was actually fine. We just need to clear out all the cars around him and get him going, get him back um, up where he needed to be. Nothing's rubbing. Everything looks real good on the car. Um, and that wasn't your fault. It looked like the 3 and the 88 got together, so you're good. And here with a third place finish. And uh, how did you feel? How did you feel with your car? It was pretty good. It was really tight, and it was, it was just a little bit tight. You got anybody that you want to thank here? Um, I'd like to th thank the Lord first of all, and my family, and Kirby, Kirby Gobble Racing, and um, I'd like to thank Bellatorum Solutions and Regent Pit Marketing, and um, awesome to design concepts. Uh, it just felt really good to be able to thank a few more sponsors in Winter Circle. Well, that's good. A good, solid third place finish. Carter, I just was told that you're only 12 years old. So if you keep racing, this is what you're going to look like. <laughs> just a little warning there. <laughs> but good job. Thank you. So after starting fourth on this race, uh, Carter worked his way up, uh, you know, made it through the little crash there without any damage and um, ended up having a good, strong finish. Did I cut down on you a little bit? 3 and 88 got together, whatever. You, you smoked to try to get away from me. And when you was there, I tried to go to get away from you and there was 88. He said it wasn't you. So after a more than hectic and chaotic day at the track, it was really good to see Carter bring home a third place finish. Really good job. Thanks. Proud of you. Billy likes racing with you. And then to end the night, Lonesome Pine did an awesome display um, of fireworks that night, and it was really fun. Carter County is located in the beautiful mountains of Northeast Tennessee. Interested in history? Come and learn the history of Carter County, the location of the first democratic government on this continent. Elizabethan and Carter County were originally known as the Watauga Settlement, which was settled in 1770. Located on the Watauga River and centered on the Sycamore Shoals River crossing, this was the first of four permanent settlements located in the Appalachian Mountains. Take a stroll through downtown Elizabethan with its many interesting antique shops, spectacular restaurants, a summer cruise in which runs every Saturday evening from April through October, or catch the Covered Bridge Festival in June with music, vendors, and fun. Carter County has something for everyone, whether it's shopping downtown, taking part in one of our many annual festivals and events, or enjoying the great outdoors. Carter County has it all. Get lost in the striking landscapes that are Carter County. Go back in time and experience the history that shaped this nation. Visit, stay, and enjoy Carter County, Tennessee's mountain playground.
We went down to Nationals and opened up with a very difficult game. Our team from California came out to win 3-2. to two. Um, had another difficult game from the team from Ohio, but I think we were a little more in control of that match. So we had two wins, a draw and a loss. Uh, so we were very disappointed because we felt that we had a shot to win Nationals and we came up a little short. Um, I think a bit of the silver lining for that was we had the most girls on the all-tournament team, uh, Cami being one of them. We were super close to winning the national championship, but we ended up getting third and it was a good season overall. So, Caden, you know, we're fixing to pull off. Caden comes down and tells me that uh, the race is canceled. The race is canceled. Are you kidding? Kirby just called? And it's canceled? Mm -hmm. Shoot. That's aggravating. We got all that stuff rushed and got it all in here. Yeah. God. Yeah, so we had stayed up um, making some bags of candy. Heather had went and got some candy and some Bible verse cards. and We had put together some little candy bags with Carter's racing sticker and just some things that we were going to hand out because that's my favorite part is to be able to see Carter um, interact with the, especially the young kids that come up. And it was supposed to be fan appreciation which is really neat for the fans that come out and uh, watch the races and get behind different drivers which is exciting. Alright, I'm about to leave. i got to go and meet Jacket too. Where are you going? We're going kayaking. Yeah, I'll see you at the race. No, it's canceled. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay, Just I'll call, call us in a little bit. Alright, love you. Bye. Love you. Man, we got a lot of stuff planned for tonight. So I'm 16 now and I got my license and I'm on the roads. What is she doing, Dad? So Caden hollers at me and tells me that Cammie, who is our newest uh, licensed driver in the family, is backing out kind of where my Jeep is pretty much directly behind her. He's going to hit the Jeep or go off the side of the Oh my gosh, I cannot believe that Cammie was trying to back out of the driveway with the Jeep right there. Cammie, what are you doing? You're going to hit the Jeep. Just wait a second. Give us just a second. Cammie, stop. It's stop. Fine. It's fine. It's fine. Just let it go. Just stop. Just stop. All I was trying to do was just get Cammie to stop because I really didn't want her to hit my Jeep. You're going to hit the Jeep. Oh my gosh. I don't know what they were worried about. I wasn't going to hit Dad's Jeep. Wasn't even close. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're at the uh, Food City Family Race Night. Uh, this is one of the NASCAR premier events, uh, pre race events, and uh, we're fortunate enough to be living right here in our backyard and have this right here in Bristol. Um, and then this year we're lucky because Regent Pen and Marketing loaded us up with some awesome merchandise that Carter's going to be able to sell to put that money back into the race car. So we're really, really, really excited about that. So like everything we've tried to do this season, um, I, uh, including racing, it's, it's rained. It rained out the other day, the fan appreciation night at Lawson Pine. And, that's raining out uh, Food City Family Race Night, so I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what's going on with the racing gods right now. <laughs> so, uh, not been favorable, but um, we'll have fun. Hopefully, this will pass on through. <laughs> appreciate Cliff uh, getting the car down here and being a big part of what Carter's doing and and um, it's, a, it's a really big deal just to be honest with you to have people to help at this level because we're not fully funded other than uh, 
than, than me. So, uh, <laughs> and again, in Regent and Bellatorium and, and, uh, and Awesome Design Concepts are our three main people that help us. So we have to supplement that a lot. And uh, Cliff, Cliff helped us out a lot this morning getting the car down. <laughs> Futsi Family Race Nights, uh, it's really fun to do every year. I've been doing it uh, since we did go-karts. It's just fun to be able to see all the fans and uh, sign autographs and everything. And <laughs> he's, got a, he's got a TV show coming out in January. Yeah, on the CW4. Awesome, awesome. So. Thank you. Thank you, you That's handsome awesome. thing. You remind <laughs> me of my grandson. Probably one of my favorite parts is uh, Food City always brings all the food. So we could go back there and eat, and it's it's really good food. So of course, one of my favorite parts of Food City Family Race Night is the food because you can go in there and basically get whatever you want as many times as you want. <laughs> Look, no, just eat the fly. It's still alive. It's not gonna be alive when oh, it's in your stomach. So I just fixed my first plate of the day and I had gotten some fruit and some fruit dip, which is one of my favorite things to get from there. And I had taken the first bite and then I went down to get a second bite and there was a gnat in my fruit dip. You are <laughs> I cannot believe he did that. That's absolutely disgusting. So gross. That's disgusting. Ooh, it's in my throat. It's probably fluttering around. That's disgusting. Cliff, that was horrible. Gross. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're right here with, I believe it's Mr. Carter Davison right here, and I found out that he's a young driver here, and it's hard to believe that he's even driving. Let's find out how old he is and what he raised. Carter, I want to talk to you a little bit. Seem like a young driver. You have your license, man. Are you able to drive one of these cars? What are you driving, man? Um, it is called a Mod 4. Um, I'm racing at Lonson Pine Speedway in okay. Coburn, Virginia. So how long have you been racing? Um, I've been racing since I was four years old. Oh, awesome. So did you start off with what, bikes, go-karts? What did you start doing? Um, I started off racing bicycles when I was four and a half, and then I went into go-karts, and then now uh, I raced a Bandolero, and now I'm racing uh, Mod 4. Oh, that's awesome. Man. So you're racing Mod 4 cars, man. So is this your first year doing this? Uh, yes, sir. So how well are you doing, man? Um, right now I'm leading the points. Come on, the points leader right now? Oh, my goodness. So how many more races you got? Uh, we have two more races, I think. Okay, so that would make you possibly, I guess, this is your first year. Could be a rookie of the year and a championship. Is that right? Yes, sir. Oh, man, that's awesome. Hey, Carter Davidson right here. Hey, this is the future right here. Right now, he says he's the points leader for Lonesome Pine at the Lonesome Pine track, and that means also he could possibly be the rookie of the year. A couple of races ago, man. Stay tuned. Watch this guy, Carter Davidson. It's coming at you. In an emergency, would your organization know what to do next? Bellatorum Solutions can help you be ready. 35 years of combined security experience, planning, preparation, and training. Don't wait till it's too late. Papa Lock is a full-service mobile locksmith. We offer automotive key makes and programming or can assist in your home or office locksmith needs in the Tri-Cities and surrounding areas. Papa Lock is locally owned and operated. Champion Chevrolet on the Motor Mile in Johnson City is starting off 2018 with monster savings on over 350 new Chevrolets to choose from. Take advantage of these awesome savings for a limited time only. Silverado Crew and Double Caps, 10,000 off MSRP, 17 Spark, 11,995, 18 Equinox, 19,995, 17 Traverse, 28,995, 17 Corvette, 20% off MSRP. Shop us online 24-7 and don't forget our Saturday parts and service hours. Champion Chevrolet on the Motor Mile in Johnson City, where we leave you asking, how do they do that? When it comes to your most meaningful moments in life, come to Dempsey's Jewelers, carrying a great selection of sought-after brands. Dempsey's Jewelers, in the heart of Johnson City. For clothing, boots, tack, and accessories, visit Double C Western Supply in Elizabethan. Come see us or visit cowgirlchrome.com. Visit, stay, and enjoy Carter County, Tennessee's Mountain Playground. The promised land Hey guys, we're down here at Simple Blessings General Store, downtown Elizabethan. Uh, one of the coolest places downtown. Y'all gotta come down here and check it out. We just had one of the best sandwiches in the Tri-Cities. And now... Get back and watch the show. <laughs> Yeah. On our 
CYB page. Yeah. And we'll kind of say what's going on. Give me like a couple minutes just yeah. to get everything. You just take your time. You just do your thing. I just want to introduce Carter to okay. you, and so that amazing. way y'all know each other. And then just he's used to doing this kind of stuff. So y'all cool. just y'all just talk. He said you're leaving points of Lonesome. I have not made it up there yet. I need jets. I've been to Kingsport. I haven't been up Lonesome yet. Man, we'd love for you to come up there. We race this coming Saturday the 26th, and then September the 2nd is Championship Night. <laughs> How old are you, dude? I'm 12 years old. Which is 12. And look at the dag and trophies you've already won. Thank you. Thank You're you. awesome, dude. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good time. Yeah. Yeah. You guys have fun. Thanks for coming out. Had a little fun at Food City Race Night. Then. We did, yeah. It was uh, racing serious enough, so we decided we'd have some fun at Food City Family Race Night over at, uh, up in Bristol this year. You like the shirts? Oh man, that's that yeah. a really nice shirt. Man. You want me to sign one? Oh, I'd love that. Yeah, okay. Well, they're normally twelve bucks, but since it's you, I'm gonna give you one. Okay, you can just have it. Does that sound good? Yeah. Let's, let's sign it, and then we'll then we'll let you. Yeah. Hey, enjoy it, man. Thank you. Thank you. They're free. Tell everybody. We, we got I'll, we got a few extras. So if anybody I'll wants a T-shirt, let them know. And uh, Carter and Dean had stepped away, and there was nobody there to sign autographs. And there were a lot of kids coming up, a lot of fans. And so uh, me and one of the other guys, we stepped in and decided to be Carter and Dean. And we took care of the autographs for a little while. I didn't know that he sat down and started signing autographs in Carter's place because uh, there was no actual pictures of Carter. So next year we'll probably have some pictures of Carter up there. Yeah, you want to sure have one, man. Yeah, they're free. Yeah, no oh, yeah, get them too if you want one. Oh, you want yeah, thank you. Yeah, you can have them. You're good. Yeah, instead of left turn living, that was left turn giving. We were giving away t-shirts because they weren't selling, so we just thought at least get some publicity, we'd just give them out. So the tiger from Lonesome, uh, Lonesome Pine, he came by and got about 50, and he's just going to give them out to random people on the street. Just a goodwill gesture. We thought Dean would appreciate just a little more publicity. We uh, obviously lose money every year at this racing deal, so we, we, need, the, we need to sell the t-shirts, not give the t-shirts away. So we're going to have to have a talk, a meeting, a family meeting with him and uh, tell him that when we're gone, he's supposed to watch stuff, make sure people don't take stuff, and to quit giving stuff away. We knew that would drive Dean nuts. So Dave, you're going to have to pay for all these t-shirts. Uh, Caden's got a list of what sizes and how many we had of each and how many we sold that day. So whatever the difference is, you're going to have to pay for those. Right there? Yeah, the guys that do that over in Bristol don't do it that way. <laughs> I'm just letting you know. My own style. So that's the proper technique with the credit card. To me, but now I'm sure there's somebody watching the show that uh, actually does this for a living. We just do left turns for a living. <laughs> Carter County is located in the beautiful mountains of Northeast Tennessee, a haven for outdoor enthusiasts throughout the year. With four distinct seasons, visitors may select the time of year that best fits their interests. Whether it's hiking in the spring, fishing or golfing in the summer, viewing leaves and mountain biking in autumn, or cross-country skiing in the winter, there are a myriad of exciting and challenging outdoor activities available. Get a fresh approach to marketing with Region Pen and Marketing. Tomorrow's ideas today. Visit RegionRocksMarketing.com, your one-stop source for marketing and promotional products. Awesome design concepts from racing company trucks, storefronts, t-shirts, and more. Call today, 865-809-6209. 
So we're going into the next to last race of the season. Uh, Carter has been has maintaining the points lead, uh, and so we've we've calculated the points from from each race and where everybody else is at as well. And uh, right now, Carter just needs to continue to finish finish ahead of Billy Duty in the one car. And if he can do that this week, um, that should have a have him wrapped up in the points championship, um, even with one race to go. getting ready for the premiere party when um, Left Turn Living will show for the first night and um, Chris had a contact out of Greenville that does cakes and so he said hey I'm gonna bring her by you can meet her maybe she can do the cake for you and I said sure we'll be happy to meet her and so she came and we sat down and talked about the cake and she told us um, the name of her bakery tell me the name of your your bakery it's the Nakery Cake Boutique and what is the, how'd you get that name? How'd you choose? Well, um, we decided to do. Oh, it is. Oh, did you it? See, Naked Cakes, they're a different style cake. And this is what helped me decide to do this professionally just because yeah. it is a completely different from other style cakes yeah. that people do. I knew when she started talking about Naked Cakes, I knew what a Naked Cake was because I had seen them in magazines and on TV. but. Now, Dean wasn't really quite clear on what a naked cake was. <laughs> That's okay. what I was thinking. It was like yeah. less icy. Yeah. That's well, see, a lot of people think that like, I don't think I'll do his a naked cake. Yeah, well. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A naked cake is a cake where you kind of like, see, you can see the cake. Yeah, yeah, you can yeah, still kind of see the cake. I'm so I thought this could be an interesting conversation, um, especially from Dean's perspective, trying to figure out what a naked cake was. Not but see, it's right. a little misleading though. A lot of people <laughs> think that the naked cake doesn't have a lot of icing on, but between the layers, there actually yes. is oh, quite a bit of icing. So you still get plenty of okay. icing. Okay. It's, just, it's just the style of the that, cake. I was getting worried because I like a lot of icing. So <laughs> no, you. It, if we were to do his uh, the naked icing. style, it would have it would have plenty of icing. It would. So yeah, you can still accommodate the icing. Oh, okay, the icing. I got you. <laughs> So she um, showed us some of her cakes that she's done in the past and the way she incorporates color and design and candy and just makes them very unique and, and really fun for kids. Um, she does them for weddings as well, but the kids' cakes look really fun. So um, we kind of got together with some ideas on Carter's favorite candies, his colors, his racing colors, um, the racing theme, and so I'm excited to see what she's going to come up with. Thanks, Anna. See ya. Call Keep Yachts at KY Construction for all your excavating needs. When it comes to your most meaningful moments in life, come to Dempsey's Jewelers. Carrying a great selection of sought-after brands, Dempsey's Jewelers in the heart of Johnson City. For clothing, boots, tack, and accessories, visit Double C Western Supply in Elizabethan. Come see us or visit cowgirlchrome.com. Barnett Guns in Hampton has the American Tactical 12-gauge pump shotgun for $199. New handguns starting at $136. Largest selection of guns, ammo, and accessories in the region. Whether you are new to firearms or a seasoned shooter, we gladly share our product knowledge and enthusiasm for the shooting sports. We are truly thankful for your business. Barnett Guns in Hampton, Tennessee. Papa Lock is a full-service mobile locksmith. We offer automotive key makes and programming or can assist in your home or office locksmith needs in the Tri-Cities and surrounding areas. Papa Lock is locally owned and operated.
Simple Blessings General Store is an old-fashioned store featuring candy, glass bottles, sodas, local crafts, and more. Home of the Lunch Bucket Deli 2, located in beautiful historic downtown Elizabethan. With acts of violence increasing every day, planning, preparation, and training are key to surviving. Bellatorum Solutions can help you be ready for rapidly changing threats. So, if it happened today, would you be ready? Get a fresh approach to marketing with Region Pen and Marketing. Tomorrow's ideas today. Visit RegionRocksMarketing.com, your one-stop source for marketing and promotional products. Awesome design concepts from racing company trucks, storefronts, t-shirts, and more. Call today, 865-809-6209. Okay, so it's homecoming week, and I was so thankful um, to be able to be chosen for one of the candidates. And besides picking out the dress, which was super stressful, um, the next thing on the list was to get my makeup, and I knew just the place to go. Hi, it's the Davidson Girls. Hey, How y'all doing? How are you doing? Well, I got nominated for homecoming, Yay. so I just decided I'd come in and get some new foundation and stuff. Awesome. And get up. Well, hop up here okay. and we're going to match you up. So we're just needing foundation. You think you're ultra powder? Uh, yeah, really just whatever you think. Okay, and yeah. I'm thinking probably like for your foundation, for every day we'll do a liquid, but let's do okay. the total finish and we've done that before. Okay. You know? Yeah. So, what color is your dress? It's red. Red? Yes. I love it. Oh, yeah, yes. I've never worn that before. Are you super so. excited? Yes, I'm so excited. Yes, we'll red you up, girl. <laughs> yes, we'll red you up, girl. Okay, now let's just do a color match. We're going to see. I'm thinking probably creamy beige. Okay. Because your color's going to basically stay the same, right? Yeah. Okay. I think I'm going to get a spray tan, though. Okay, great. So it'll probably great. be a little. The healthier, for, the healthy tan. Yeah. So. <laughs> All right, we gotcha. It matches perfectly. I love it. You know how you sisters approve. are. Yeah. I was going to say, that's your, that's your biggest critic. Yeah. So, I do. I like that. All right. Well, let's go see what we can do, buddy, and get this uh, get this car for Miss Caden. Does that sound good? Yes, sir. This is We're so cool. Right they're getting, uh, they're doing the hair and the makeup and getting all that stuff done. Oh, no! Getting ready for homecoming was really stressful, probably because on the way home from school, uh, me and Bailey, well, I was driving, but Bailey was with me, and I got pulled over and got a speed ticket, so that really set the stress level pretty high already, uh, and then, you know, you have mom trying to put lipstick on, Bailey trying to fix the hair, and then Kami's just running around, not really sure what she was doing, so it, it was really stressful. I feel a left turn coming this way. Next on Left Turn Living. I don't know what Tim was thinking. He's got um, two race car drivers in his nicest Corvette on the lot. So uh, he may not have been thinking too clearly when he told me we could have this. What'd you do? Break it? Like that? What'd you do? Hey, it won't. I feel a left turn coming this way. Left Turn Living. Thanks for watching Left Turn Living. Be sure to join us live after every episode on Carter Davison Racing. So go watch it now.